so cold out here. To them birds flying free, fish in the sea, flowers and trees, every little bumblebee. I want to sing. Turned all orange. I think Blue, Blue doesn't know what's going on. <clears throat> Let me see what. Blue doesn't know what's going on. All my friends on Facebook are saying about this cold weather today. It's cold. Hold it's on. cold. All right. Thankful for this cool morning. Okay. Wait a minute. Ain't done. What else we got? Come here, Starly. Let's see your new coat. Starly got her winter coat already. We got Journey a coat, but it's not. Hers is more like a thinner coat. Weather friendly enough for the Uggs. Really? Mm -hmm. Uggs? No. Hang on there. Let's no. See what, let's see what everybody else is saying. Loving this weather this morning. Let's play some football. Where'd our baby go? <laughs> Get the ball. I like your coat. Is it my brad? You smell my brad? Come here. Oh, no. Oh, she, <laughs> dang, girl. Look at her, Dad. Don't she look good? How's your pockets? Do you got deep pockets? Oh, yeah. Wow, look how deep those pockets are. Great for flea marking with Raffi and Piggy. Great for flea marketing. Does it come with a hood? I think it might be in that little pouch. Is it? Do you got a pouchy? No, 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 no hood. But you got this thing. A nice scarf. What is oh, this Oh, don't for? pull on this too much. What is it for? That's to tighten it up. Oh. These things right here, you pull them, you push them down and pull them up like little stoppers. Oh. Now I gotta go get my eggs. You don't even own any eggs. <laughs> Look at the muscles, Dad. Whoa. Oh, don't drop it on your toes. <laughs> Show her those muscles. <laughs> How do you do? <laughs> oh, can't do that one. Oh. <laughs> Nope. Just hug that one. Oh, can you do that one? <laughs> Don't stop it. <laughs> Jump up and make some shoes out of them. <laughs> we have to make that one into a ghost. Journey. Run around that table. Now sit down. Tell, which one's the biggest pumpkin? Show me the biggest pumpkin. Journey, which one's the biggest one? I don't want to touch the stairs, the What's the biggest pumpkin? <laughs> Great pumpkin, Charlie Brown. Journey, where's the big pumpkin? Are you getting your mouth? Pick it up. Pick it up. Go give it to Dad. <laughs> Oh yeah, put it on the table. Oh, it's a big pumpkin. Make sure it don't roll off. Bring me one. Go get palm one. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Can 
picking it. Maybe just oh, make careful. sure it don't drop on her toes. That's a that's a heavy one. Yeah, I know. <laughs> You did, you did a good job growing these pumpkins, girl. We didn't need no fertilizer. <gasps> oh. oh, it's a rubber pumpkin. Damn. <laughs> these aren't really pumpkins. No, I, I like like 16 screws finishing this. Day. Careful. No, 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 no. Be careful. <laughs> Karate chop. We'll kick it off the back. <laughs> Dad, can you time me? See how fast I can go around the whole house? Hang on. Oh. When you mark, get set, go. <laughs> I need a coffee. Man, me and you both. Hey guys, welcome to the vlog. It is now Saturday, October the 5th. We're outside of a GameStop. Are you guys surprised? Probably not. Um, I don't remember the last thing I vlogged, but it was probably, I don't know. Yesterday we went to North Carolina and we went to, where'd we go? Oh, my husband's looking for some figures, some because it was Force Friday, and they have new Star Wars figures coming out. If you didn't know, he's a collector. He collects um, toys, <laughs> I guess, um, but only like certain ones. He doesn't want like the whole collection or anything like that. So it was Force Friday, and so he wanted like a couple figures that were coming out. And if he don't hurry up and go out and get them. He ain't gonna get them because there's people that scalp them that like go out and buy them and then sell them for a, a higher price but but anyway um so we like today is like the first saturday like we don't have anything planned um for the past few weeks we've always had something that we were planning and going on and we were gonna go to the flea market this morning but it was it was supposed to be raining, but it, it's not raining. So, um, we just kind of slept in, which is good because I was like really, really tired. I had like a crazy, crazy dream. Um, so then we just kind of, you know, sat around and we went outside this morning and now we went to go get us a Dunkin' Donuts coffee. My husband's like, hey, let's go over here. And I'm like, okay. So we're over here in Gaffney. It's not too far from Gastonia. And that is where the Long Mills Creek, um, Long Creek Mills, is that what's called? Long Mill Creek? I don't even know, y'all. But that's where that place is going out of business, a thread place. Um, and they're open. I had it on my phone, darn it. What'd I do with it? So I told my husband, I was like, it's like 32 minutes away. And he was like, all right. He's like, what time they close? And I said, five o'clock. So he wants to stop. He wanted to stop at this GameStop first and then Walmart. So we're going to stop at those two places. And then we're going to head on over there. Um, Long Creek uh, Mills. So that'll be fine. And yeah 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 i'm glad we're getting a chance to go over there because for the next like every weekend we pretty much have something planned um, you know we want to go to dollywood and that's probably going to be gosh john let me... i don't know what weekend we're going it's still kind of up in the air at this point but I want to go this month. It's already the 5th. My husband's birthday is next weekend. Actually, his birthday is in 10 days. Let me know. I'll be dog. What day are we going to go to Dollywood? Why are you way back there, hon? 
Well, listen, her birthday's on a Monday. Journey's birthday's on a well, Monday. Because I, I put my baby boots to a nap. Okay. Journey's birthday's on a Monday, so we can have her birthday party the following. Or, or is that church? Church what? Is church going to be on that Saturday or is church the Halloween thing at church? Is that going to be on a Saturday or is that going to be on Halloween? I didn't know they were doing one this year. I don't know if they are or not. I just assumed they were. Okay, so this coming weekend it's going to be the 12th. And then your birthday's the 15th. Okay. Well, I ain't worried about my birthday. I know. I, but. I'm, um, but I, I just. I missed two days this past week because of my foot. I know. And I don't want to be like, oh, I'm going to go to Littlewood blah, blah, so blah. I can go walk around Dollywood. I know. Um, so I'm not thinking not this weekend, but the following weekend, like the 19th. And then if church isn't doing, like we can even have her birthday party on a Sunday. So if we did her birthday party on the 27th, which is a Sunday, because it's just going to be at our house. I know. And it'll be like, Seven, six days after her birthday, but. Oh, no, no, no. No one. I, to, I hate it whenever it has to be split up like that. I would rather it, her, I would rather her party fall as close to her birthday as possible. Yeah. I, don't, I don't like it whenever it gets goofed up like that. I, I just, I mean, I know that, that, that I, I know the little, 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 that always can't be helped, but. It's just like, oh yeah, we weren't able to have their birthday party, so we're having it six months later. Oh no, we're and not just, do that. This would just be six days after her part. I mean, it's either going to be the weekend before or the weekend after. This would be the weekend after. Hey, I'm going to go in here. Okay, I'll let you. We're at Walmart. Figure? I'm gonna get some. I'm gonna get some before I leave. When does it run? Yeah. I need all of it. More Sterling. City. Oh, I like this orange. It's pretty. Oh my gosh. Do we need some blue?
Do you need some thread? Actually, I need black. I need black. I don't know. I thought you had her. I need black. Hold on, I'm trying to find black. Okay. I like this blue. <laughs> yes, baby. Yes. Come this way. Come here. Sissy's over here. Yeah, yeah. Hi. What? Hey guys, so we left there and oh my gosh, they have so much thread. So much thread. It is crazy. It is almost to the point where it's kind of overwhelming. Um, but I didn't, I really don't need any thread and I know, I know, I know. I know. I'm, honestly, I'll probably go back. Um, we just have a, didn't have a lot of time. They close at 5 o'clock and it's 4.29. I mean, could have spent about 30 minutes in there. Um, did it, but I did pick up a couple of things. Um, number one, I picked up black because I need black and the black is not on sale. The black, she said, they don't spin there or nothing. It's sent to them. So the black was $6.99. So I had to pay full price for it, which it's fine. Normally, um, the Madeira thread. This is exquisite. The Madeira thread is, um, what, seven, what is it, seven ninety nine? I don't even remember. Anyway, and then I saw this and she was like, it's only, $2.39. She's like, it's only $2.39. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna try it. This is, um, the invisible Put thread. In so I have a big invisible thread and somebody commented and said that it is itchy so I'm gonna try it and just find out. And then I got one more which I couldn't pass this one up because look how beautiful that is. <laughs> it's silver. It was $3.99 and actually I probably, what does it say? Metallic and true so metallic emb aluminum soft 2500 yards so I think that'll be great for uh you know what that'd be good for frozen you know that movie's coming out oh, I might have to go back and buy some I might have to say okay honey I need to go buy more thread I just didn't expect to see so much bobbin I know I'm calling it bobbin but I know anyway you saw bobbin in there too and they had zippers and just so much and then when but you don't buy, you wonder what, what she said that woman came in yesterday and bought all the ribbon. Yeah, what kind of ribbon? It might, it might have been your glue. Yeah. My glue. Oh. Yeah. And then when you leave, you get a little parting gift bag. <laughs> so, uh, you get a bag of scraps. You get a bag of scraps, like stuff you won't use. Is it Value Village over here? <gasps> Is it Value Village over here? Yeah. We're not business. Nuh uh. Dad, do you think we could run in there? Did you know that 
that they're gonna have to take that beach down. Why? Kind of worm, ain't it? <gasps> oh, journey, Jern. Hey, bye. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Two-headed shark. Hey guys, we are home. I'm in my natural habitat. <laughs> I am downstairs. Alyssa's spending the night. The computer's taking forever to turn on. It did an update yesterday, so. But I'm just unpacking some of the stuff I bought yesterday and today, which is some glitter ribbon. From Hobby Lobby, I had a person order in all. Um, and I got so many bags down here. Filling up my trash can. Um, I had somebody order a black tutu with purple glitter ribbon. And I think I need... I don't remember if I need six or if I needed seven. I do got some somewhere. in a little bit, so... These are what, three? Yeah, I need one more. And I actually, I think I have, I need 10 yards for the top and 10 yards for the bottom. I think. I'm pretty sure because it's black, it's dark. So um, a lot of times with like the darker color tutus, you don't have to necessarily use as much tool as you would like if it was a white tutu. Of course, you want to use, make sure you use a lot of tool to make sure it's not see through. So, this is a black one with purple. So, um, and you guys know this stuff is $3.99 when it's not on sale. I mean, yeah, when it's not on sale. When it's on sale, it's half price. It's two bucks. So, Two, four, six, eight, twelve, fourteen. It'd be like fourteen dollars worth of ribbon. I don't even remember how much I charged them. And then I'm gonna go to this because it's over there. I know I showed it earlier, but I did buy the clear. Like they had so much thread there. I don't know how good my footage is. It's just like overwhelming, and I was just like, <gasps> so I was kind of like all over the place. I was like this, like my camera's here and I'm like, <laughs> you know <laughs> but hopefully you guys can see some of it, but yeah, so this is the clear thread and I know I mentioned this before about using this on tutus and somebody said something about it being itchy, which I can understand that because if it's like nylon and you know how you get the itchy tags in the back that's sewn on with that stuff. Oh my gosh. That's like the worst stuff ever. So I don't know if this will be good or if it'll be bad or if it'll work out, you know, or if it'll make any difference whatsoever. Um, you know what I mean? If they'll even notice. it. Was, I mean, it seems pretty, pretty darn thin. I don't think it would really, I mean, it don't feel like it would be itchy, you know what I mean? I don't even know if you guys can see it. Yeah, well, maybe you can. This is like really, I don't even know the thickness on this. I mean, if it works, great. It was only like $2 and something. And if it don't, then I wasted $2 and something. Now this is, it was full price. It was $6.99. It's just black. And I'm running low. That is all the black I have, which is up there. And the last time I ordered thread, I don't know why I didn't order black. I ordered white. And so, um, and so I, I didn't know whether or not I should, like, you know what I mean? Like, truly invest in this thread because I've never tried it with my machine. And what happens if I spend, you know, $100 on thread there and it not work out with my machine. So that's why I was like, I was just getting stuff that I absolutely know I could probably put to use like this black. If it works, then yay me. Um, this, which you know what I want to use that for. And then this, which I'm like, if this turns out and works good, then I'm probably going to go up there again before they close up she just didn't she didn't know when they would close 
because I still had a ton of inventory. Um, but how to get this? There we go. But this is just gorgeous. It is just so shimmery and so. It's not gonna focus, but it is so beautiful. This stupid camera just wants to focus on my face. But yeah, that's so shiny. Okay. And that's all I bought besides this little I didn't buy this. This was like a goodie bag. Or, and it has two threads. These two. I don't, I don't know what those are about. But it's got some little ones. And it's got some pink bobbins. And it's got some blue bobbins. And it's got some burgundy bobbins. Bo bobbins. Bobbins. Anyway. Um, at Walmart, I picked up more scissors. I pick these up like almost every other week. There's probably a million laying over there. There's some over here. There's some over there. Um, what happens is they get dull, especially cut in vinyl. Um, the glitter vinyl. It gets dull cutting these. But if you use HTV, it's not as bad on HTV. But I've tried to... It's kind of funny because different ones have different marks on them. Like when I get a new pair, I'll kind of like mark it in some way. That way I know these are my new ones or newer ones. Um, and then like some of them have like dots on them. Like a, with a Sharpie one, I put a nick in it with like a pair of scissors just so I knew. I knew just so I know. But yeah, they don't last too long. They're only, um, these ones came from Walmart 7 98 99 I don't know. And I've been on the hunt for a size 8 boys t-shirt in black. Um, this person specifically ordered a size 8 boys t-shirt. So I picked up... Oh, wow. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Um... So, at Walmart, the Wonder Nations has a size 8, and um, Airb Blanks is out of black boy shirts. They only had like an 18 month left, I think. So, I couldn't order from them. I ordered it from Cavio, but that order probably won't be until Monday, and it needs to ship out by Monday. So, um, I've been on the hunt to see, and I couldn't, they, they have every size. Every Walmart, we went to three different Walmarts, all of them had... Um, 6, 7, 10, 12, and 14, 16, but no size 8. They had a size 8 in the white, so I was like, I'm just going to pick this up just to keep on hand, and mainly I wanted to see the size comparison because I picked this one up, which is a size small, which size six, says size 6, 8, which is the Gildan brand from Hobby Lobby, and these sizes are exactly the same. I mean, same? Okay, let's see if we can. So, they're up here. I mean, the bottom, the... Uh, let me just do it like this. So, here is these two right here. They are the same. If anything, I mean this this gilded might be just a just a smidgy bigger, but width wise they are exactly the same. So I think if I use this size six to eight, I think it will be fine. But I don't want people to get the you know what I mean? I don't want them to get it and be like I ordered a size 8, and this size says 6 to 8. Um, but yeah, I think it'll work out fine. Then I had somebody order a size 12 month black shirt for a boy in, um, like I said, they didn't have any. So I got this 12 to 18 month at Hobby Lobby. Hopefully that will work. I picked up more of this, um... Mario print fabric because I haven't saw it anywhere else and I've actually sold a couple of those so and then we got more glitter 
I was trying to, since it was on sale this week, I was trying to get the rainbow. They didn't have orange. And then I had the only purples I bought for that one. So um, if I do happen to sell another glitter ribbon trim, um, yeah, I just need an orange and a purple. And then I just got this little remnant of fabric. I'm gonna go ahead and do a little bit of work. It is Saturday night, we got church tomorrow. I gotta make something for homecoming, which I'm going to make. We decided we're gonna do baked spaghetti just because it's easy and quick and it'll feed a lot of people. So um, I plan on making that in the morning. I told my husband, nobody likes like, it's better when it's fresh. So I'll probably get up about, I don't know, eight o'clock and start it and then um, mix everything together and then probably like 30 minutes before we leave put it in the oven and then take it to church while it's hot so get some work done I just did a boo-boo <laughs> I'm gonna pause you ready and pause so I'll close this door journey's out there but I had my this color, which is called Carbon, which is a really, really dark, dark blue. I don't know if you can tell, but it's super dark. And it's what I need for like a design I do. So, um, but that was one of the last designs I did. And so it was in place of the yellow. And I don't know why I didn't even check my thread colors, but I didn't. So when it went to do the yellow, um, First it does a streak down the middle, and then it does her hair. Well, my streak is now that color, so. <laughs> oh well, I'll make more. Hey guys, so it's after midnight. It is actually 12.32, oh my goodness, Um. anyway. I need to head to bed. I gotta get up early and make that in the morning. But I did want to show you guys a couple things I made tonight. So I made this for Sterly. Um, and the shirt I used is a boys um, 1416. And it says Husky. So um, the reason being is... I want something that will fit her like maybe this year and then maybe next year I don't know depends on how big you know but as it is like her 14 16s are getting a little bit small on her that totally makes me sad because um, that means her and journey won't be able to match you know like from children's place but I mean some 14 16s still fit her like perfect but then there's some like I, I noticed a lot of like um, like things from Walmart, the 1416s don't fit. And it's just probably sizing. But um, she pretty much still is like, you know, into like um, things, girly, little kid things. She don't wanna, she don't wanna wear the junior stuff. <laughs> um, so anyway, uh, and I had this fabric. And when I saw that, I was like pumpkin and I know most people probably wouldn't go with blue and orange, but I just love blue and orange together. And let me tell you something else. I saw this fabric at Hobby Lobby yesterday, and I was like, oh, that'll be make a perfect pumpkin. I know it's blue. I know pumpkins aren't blue, but I just, I don't know. I have things that pop in my head all the time when I see certain fabrics. And I know it probably don't make sense to some people, but to me it was like, uh, and I love the way it turned out. So now Journey has this one. So I don't love them. So Starley's is more of a turquoise because there was more turquoise in the pumpkin. I probably could have done it in the same colors, but I didn't want to. So they have these, and they're so cute. And then, um, I gotta cut a thread, but I made this one for Jern. It's the bug shirt. 
Um, I got this fabric at Joann's. I don't know. Uh, I think it was on my birthday, actually. But I wanted something colorful, and it's got, like, a caterpillar, and it's got a ladybug, and it's got a butterfly, and it's got another part of a bug there, and a bee, and, um, there was actually a few other bugs in the fabric. Like a snail. Let's see. Where's he at? I saw him on here because I was like, oh, I should have got him. I don't know. He's on here. I know. Oh, there he is. There he is. He's so cute. So, anyway, that's it for today's vlog. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to leave me a comment down below because I love to read them. And if you haven't yet, um, I have a Facebook account. It's called Sterling's, no, Sterling, S-T-E-R-L-I-N-G, and then Styles with an S. Although my YouTube is Sterling's, like it's Sterling, like, like my daughter, like it's her style, Sterling's style, but my Facebook is Sterling Styles, because that's the way I had to have it. But anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.